Hello silver friends, this is Jolie from Quicksilver Hair and today we're going to talk about 23 things that I found to be favorites of 2023. These are things I repurchased, things I fell in love with, and so forth. It is everything from skincare to makeup to hair care and hair accessories and a few extra little goodies. I wanted to do a video like this at the start of November because it's a great time to find gifts and to give you gift ideas. And whether you buy them for yourself or someone you love, I thought you would like to see some of the things that I fell in love with. If that all sounds good to you, stick around. Before we get started, I want to celebrate a couple of milestones. This is my 100th video, which I am so excited because I never thought I would do one video, much less 100. Now that count is the full count of videos published to my YouTube channel that includes shorts, that includes some of my promo videos for Quicksilver Hair, but all in all, it's 100 videos and I think it's a really cool milestone. Second milestone is I have surpassed 3,000 followers. Thank you so much, ladies, for being here with me and I'm really excited that I am bringing you content that you want and that you are enjoying. On that note, in October, I had four videos on porosity, which was pretty intense information, and I appreciate you watching those videos, and I appreciate all of your emails that you sent. I will not be doing a Q&A video on that one because most of you found that all of the information you were looking for was provided in those videos. And I wanna give you a huge thank you for supporting me and commenting and sending emails on the menopause and hair loss video. I was very nervous to post that video because it's a sensitive topic and it's one that is laced with lots of myths and fears and lots of issues that we are trying to, as a society, wade our way out of. So I wanted to make sure that the message that I delivered in that video was one that was clear, concise, and helpful to you. And you all responded with such great emails and comments. So thank you for that, and I appreciate you being here with me. Hang in there with me to the end of this video because I will be sharing with you what is in my annual giveaway. My annual drawing is December 1st, so Stick with me and I'll share all of that with you at the end of this video. Before I go into the products, they are in order numbered from one to 23, but they are not in any particular order for my most favorite to least favorite or anything like that. I just numbered them so that I could remember where I was in showing you each product. Number one on my list is Scenes Face Wash. I fell in love with this product. There are some things that I need when it comes to cleanser, and that is that it's actually cleansing without stripping, without drying, without irritating my skin, and without causing more redness. And this fits the bill. I think probably because it is a gentle cleanser, it's non-commodogenic, and it is fragrance-free. It's available for $32 on Amazon, and you can use my coupon code at Scene directly and get a little bit extra off if you wanna shop directly at Scene. Number two on my list is the Skin Fix Barrier Plus Triple Lipid Plus Collagen Brightening Eye Treatment. It is available on Sephora for $54. It's a very lightweight cream. One of the things I like is this is a glass jar, so it's recyclable, which is very cool. Um, I find that eye creams can clog the pores around my eyes so I get little bumps, and I can also get the um, water line can get pl plugged up. Like I end up with uh, styes and irritated eye line. So I really like this one because it doesn't cause all those issues. It is worth the price at $54 to avoid all those problems. However, I really would like to find something a little less expensive. I'll say I'm not a proponent of using collagen on your skin as an effective tool to use up collagen. Collagen should actually be absorbed internally, so it should be something you are taking in in your diet, not something you put on your skin topically. To my knowledge, when you put collagen on your skin, it is too molecularly large to actually sink in. So I'm not sure what the deal is with the collagen in this, and maybe they have hydrolyzed it or something and it's a little bit more effective. I haven't noticed any, you know, like, intense wrinkling or anything like that going away. I have just noticed that my eyes do feel moisturized and that is something that's very important to me because one of the problems that I have with menopause is dry eye. And dry eye doesn't just mean the inside of my eye, but the skin around my eyes gets really dry. Anyway, great product, comes in a glass jar, which is recyclable, 
Excellent. Number three on my list is the cream from Skin Fix. This is their Skin Fix Barrier Plus Triple Lipid Peptide Refillable Face Cream. So it has a really cool feature here. You have this pump. You can push down on this pump and cream comes up in a measured dose, which is really nice because at $45 for the refill and $54 for the full container, it gets costly. However, that helps you to not use too much. It sinks right in, and as I said, this is a refillable. You open this up, and this little container right here pops off, and you put a new one in and sink it back in. Perfect little way to save on plastic, which I love, and it is a great cream. This stuff does not irritate my skin. It sinks right in, it's not greasy, and it feels really good underneath makeup. You don't have like that where you feel like you have a whole lot of layers of product to where it feels like you've just got too much on your face. Number four on my list is Pharmacy's Honey Halo Cream. This, oh, this stuff is so yummy. This is a ceramide face moisturizing cream. It is available on Amazon and it ranges in price depending on the size that you get from 13 to $74. You can guess which jar this is. I love this stuff so much that I went ahead and afforded the large container because I was using up the small container too rapidly. I find this to be really good for when my skin just gets really dry and is not doing so great with our dry air and everything. So I do swap it out with the Skin Fix, but this stuff is so rich and creamy and it smells really soft and honey-like. It's got a tiny bit of a creamy honey color to it. It is just delicious, literally. The dog likes to lick it off my face. I do alternate this out with the Skin Fix. It's not something I can use daily because it is so moisturizing and so nourishing that if I used it daily, it would cause some pimples or breakouts because it would be just too much oil on my face. Number five on my list is Elta MD UV Clear Daily Face Sunscreen, SPF 46 Oil-Free Daily Sunscreen with Zinc Oxide and it is available on Amazon for $48. I am probably on my fourth bottle now. This is one of the best sunscreens I have ever put on my face because it sinks right in, you barely know it's there, and even though it is a zinc combo um, sunscreen, you don't see that white cast on your skin, and it goes beautifully underneath makeup without any grease. There's no smell, no fragrance, and it doesn't burn your eyes. I've noticed that a lot of sunscreens, you know, when you get them up near your eyes, that it burns your eyes. You can actually put this right up underneath your eye line and right on your eyelids and no burning, no irritation around the eyes. Mm -hmm. Moving on to makeup, we'll get started with Merit's foundation and concealer stick. This is amazing. I have never found a foundation um, in any kind of wet formula that I actually fell in love with. Everything always felt like it was heavy or greasy or smelly, and it always felt like I had this coating on my face. I just couldn't stand it. The idea behind Merit Cosmetics is to have a flawless face that's natural, that you don't have like this feeling on your face of having too much on. And they really are supportive of the natural look, which is the you know makeup look that I aim for. As a matter of fact, today I have all Merit on except for my mascara and my lipstick, and I'll get into that in a second. This is a really dreamy formula, and the colors are really great. They have, let me make sure I've got this right, they have 20 shades to choose from, so no matter what your complexion is or your uh, skin tone, they have a great selection, and they well define that they are cool, warm, or neutral, so I think that's really helpful, especially when you're having to order online. I ordered Dune. And I just reordered this in Bone, which is a lighter color for my skin tone, which I actually needed from the get-go, but they didn't have it, so I had ordered this one in because it was just the next one up. And while I like it, I think I do need a slightly lighter one, especially coming into the winter months. These sticks run $38. You can get them at Merit or Sephora. Also from Merit, I got their Day Glow Dewy Highlighting Balm, and I have the color Bounce, which I'll see if you can see it. It's a beautiful color. It highlights really well, and it's kind of just a real soft, neutral color. Um, 
They're $32 and you can find them on Sephora. Today I used it along my cheekbone and I used it on my eyes as my light eyeshadow, if you will. And then I used the blush that I have from Merit as my blush for my cheeks and I used it as the pink in my eyeshadow. So number eight is my newest find and I currently have a full container of it in my cart on Sephora. It's the Rare Beauty by Selena Gomez Mascara. I, whew, I can't tell you how much I love this mascara. I'm going to try to lean in so you can see how well it uh, adds length and volume to my eyelashes. You can see how much it actually does for your lashes. I can't believe how much lash I actually had by using this product. So it's really cool and it doesn't irritate my eyes or anything. So bravo, Selena Gomez, you did a great job with this mascara. I have always worn CoverGirl um, volume mascara and it would take a very good mascara to make me shift off of that one because again one of my big issues is having anything that will irritate my eyes and so far this hasn't bothered my eyes at all so I'm really excited about this because I really love how great my lashes look with this mascara. This runs from $11 to $20 depending on the size that you get and it's available on Sephora. Number nine is Color the World Lipstick Pretty in Pink. That ended up being my favorite color from there. It is the color that I have on and it is just a really lovely, perfect pink. These lipsticks are very moisturizing. It actually feels like you've just got lip balm on, which is one of my favorite ways to wear a lipstick. I don't like lipsticks that get gummy or anything like that, but you can check out. I did a full review on all of the Cover the World lipsticks that I purchased. I'll link that up here and you can go check that out because I fell in love with this lipstick. Okay, so let's move on to some hair care products that I found um, that either are new releases, things I started using that I hadn't been using before. Maybe I went back to them. We're going to get into all that, but these are the things that kind of surprised me this year and things that I kept purchasing. First up is, by the way, purple fragrance free conditioner. You can see <laughs> I've almost used it all up. I did a full review on this and I'll link it up here so you can check that out. But this conditioner, I don't even care that it's purple. I'm not even using it because it's purple. I'm using it because it is an amazing conditioner. I actually just really fell in love with the conditioner itself. Um, it is a slightly different formula than their daily conditioner. So for whatever reason, I prefer this over their daily conditioner. It's eight ounces. It runs $16.99 on Amazon, or you can buy it directly at the By The Way Company website. Number 11 is the By The Way Life Changing Leave-In. This stuff is dynamo. I absolutely love this. I loved their first formula, and I was so happy when they got their updated formula back in stock. Also, it is in that review that I mentioned just now. This is $18.99 on Amazon, or you can buy it directly from the By The Way company. It's just a really great conditioner for silver hair. It was made for silver hair and they meant it. Number 12 on my list is Miche Indulge Deep Conditioner. This stuff is very indulgent. They got the name right. It is white and it is absolutely divine. I bought a container of this with my favorite Luss deep conditioner and I have barely touched the Luss deep conditioner which has been my all-time favorite until now and I have already gone through a whole jar of this and this is my second jar. I really encourage you if you have silver hair to give this a try. It works on straight, curly, wavy, it doesn't matter. I think it's probably good for anybody because it's just a really nice, lightweight deep conditioner. The Miche deep conditioner is $20 and it is an eight ounce container and you can get it on Amazon. After that, number 13 is the Loma Nourishing Oil. This stuff, <laughs> I've almost become addicted to it. I really use it um, sparingly. However, I've started to notice that if I use it right after my hair dries to break my cast, my curls seem to be shinier, uh, softer, and they last just a little bit longer. So it is really good at sealing the hair. I think this is an excellent product. It is a silicone based product, but I haven't found any issues with buildup with it. This runs, this is the 3.4 ounce bottle for $28.49. 
Um, it also comes in an eight ounce bottle and I think that one's like $54. It is available on Amazon and I also have a coupon code for Loma if you buy direct from them and that's all in the description box below. Number 14 is Bounce Curl Moisture Balance Leave-In Conditioner. I actually don't have a full container and I actually don't have a container intact because I am scraping the bottom of the barrel on this one, which I will cut the, I cut the tube apart and tuck it in so that I can get all the product out. I don't know if anybody noticed, but if you're a Bounce Curl fan, there was an email that was released this year and they announced that this had been certified to be heat and UV protective. So I used this all summer long because I was outside a lot with my new dogs and I found that it was very great for protecting my hair from the elements. Um, the scent is pretty potent with Bounce Curl. This one in particular doesn't bother me, but this is a very nourishing and conditioning leave-in conditioner. I highly suggest you give it a try if you haven't already. And the Bounce Curl leave-in is available on the Bounce Curl website. It is $25.99. Number 15 is something I used to use, I stopped using, and then earlier this summer I was going to do a full video in the fragrance free line for Jessie Curl. Unfortunately, Jessica died right about the time I was going to release the video and I felt like it was not appropriate for me to release the video because I didn't want anybody to think I was riding on the coattails or trying to get you know, clicks or watches or views because of her death. So I chose not to publish that video. I actually ditched it altogether. When I do videos like that, that are the fragrance free videos or a full lineup, I will often buy sample sizes just so that I can kind of go through several products and I don't have to buy the full size containers. But this product, I absolutely used up every drop of the little two ounce container. And this is the Jessie Curl Confident Coils product. I do have it in the Citrus Lavender, but I did try it in the Fragrance Free initially. I like her Citrus Lavender. It's a very light, lovely scent, so I chose to get it in that, in the full size container. This is a creamy, gel-like product. What I have found myself using it for is to smooth down frizz, say, you know, several hours or later in the day after my hair has dried, or on my second day hair. But let me show you, it's a gel product, but it's creamy. It's a really great product for like right now, just kind of smooth through. If I had any frizz, it would smooth all that frizz down. And it kind of adds a little bit more hold back into your hair. And mm, the citrus lavender smells so good. But this is available from two ounces to 16 ounces from $8 to $35. It comes in two scents and unscented and it's available on Amazon. Okay. Moving on to my new favorite towel, which is the Curly Clean towel. And pardon me, I actually accidentally stained it with the purple conditioner. So I'm actually hoping to, when I get the next one, that I get the, it comes in a gray. I'm gonna get the gray color so that that is not so obvious on there. But I love this towel. And once I figured out how to plop with it, it's the perfect towel for me because it is a double-sided t-shirt towel. So it is, it's two layers of t-shirt material. So you get extra absorbency and I just found that I really preferred this for my low porosity hair over the uh, Perfect Hair Care towel, which I still think that's a great towel. It's a great microfiber that's very smooth. So those are my top two recommendations for a uh, towel that does not disrupt the cuticle. But for me and my low porosity hair and my very long hair, this towel is excellent. They are available on Amazon for $25.99 and there are several different colors. Number 17 is the Lifen hair dryer. I never thought I would rave about a hair dryer as much as I have raved about this one. I have probably sold 45 of them at this point outside of YouTube just from telling people who ask me, you know, in person, what hair dryer do you use? My favorite feature about this dryer is that it has an oscillating heat setting where it automatically, you can set it, you don't have to touch it after you do this. You can set the button to go from 
uh, cold to warm to hot and back and forth between those three settings, which if you are a curly girl, you know that often you are hitting the cool shot on the dryer to cool it off so that your diffuser doesn't get too hot. And I find that that was an ingenious addition to this dryer. I also, since I've gotten my two puppies <laughs> with long hair, have found that it's excellent for drying their hair rather quickly. I use the concentrator nozzle on my Shih Tzu who has a pretty thick coat for such a young little fella and it gets him dry very quickly. He doesn't particularly like the hair dryer, I don't think many dogs do, but Lifen, this is the best hair dryer I've ever had. And you can get the Life and Hair Dryer on Amazon. It is $159.99. You can get $10 off with my coupon code if you go directly to the Life and website. That is in the description box below. And if you want to see my full review, I'll link it here. Number 18 on my list is a 100% Moldberry Silk pillowcase that was made in the USA. I appreciate you so very much. It was one of your followers that sent me an email to tell me about this brand because you had noticed that I was promoting a brand called Alaska Bear um, from Amazon, which is a perfectly good silk pillowcase. They are made in China. Most silk products are made in China because the silk production for the world comes from China but these are made in the United States. They're fantastic. They have a zipper enclosure. They are 22 mohm silk and they run $33 to $41 and they have the standard queen and king size available. They're all on Amazon and I really loved some of the colors. I chose this one, obviously. <laughs> Number 19 on my list is Busy Bee Headbands. These are handmade headbands by a woman owned business and I became interested in them via Instagram because I like a good soft like t-shirt type headband and I like something that's wide but fits well. And I got hooked on these by watching her videos on Instagram and I'll link all that in the description box below. But they're $18 each and there are five different styles and tons of colors and patterns. I have one on now. But I prefer the, this is a just plain gray one, but I prefer the wide headband and it has a elastic strap in the back. And then I have the um, normal width, it's not the wide one, in a tie dye. They are so buttery soft. I cannot convey <laughs> through video how soft they are, but they fit really well and they stay in place. Pardon my dog, she's gonna bark at something. And they come in a variety of patterns and colors. You will be able to find something that you love. They all cost $18. And I did become an affiliate because I fell in love with them and it is a woman owned business and I wanted to support her because she's doing a beautiful job on Instagram with her business. And anyway, they, they're just great, I love them. So if you love a good headband and maybe you're transitioning and wanna cover up that demarcation line, I encourage you to go check her out. All of her information is in the description box below. Number 20 is my wide brimmed cotton crochet hat. I got this on Amazon. It's a floppy hat, garden hat. It is UV and UPF rated. I wear the medium large. It also comes in large, extra large. They have several colors to choose from. I went for something light and I made sure to wash it before I wore it to make sure that none of the color was bleeding out. They are $25.95. They are available on Amazon. I wear this hat every day this summer for being outside with the dogs and especially in the really blazing heat. I wanted something to protect my skin and my hair and this was perfect. It's the perfect width brim and it's inexpensive. You can get a couple of them. Next up is Pure Encapsulations Hyaluronic Acid. This is the supplement form. You can get hyaluronic acid topically and in products like skin creams and also um, hair products. This ingredient is incredibly powerful at carrying water. That is its superpower. And for your eyes, it helps to keep the moisture level inside your eye balanced. And it also helps keep the sebum in your um, tear ducts from getting gummy and drying out, which I found out is a symptom of menopause. I ordered this and I started taking it and it took a little while before I really noticed, but I'm in, I'm sold. 
So the Pure Encapsulations Hyaluronic Acid is available on Amazon and it does cost $43 for 60 capsules. I take one twice a day and I've found that I could probably take more than that, but for the price I decided to just stick to two a day and I absolutely can tell the difference. And I don't like to promote supplements, so I only mention supplements when I know they are effective. Number 22 is the Perfect Crew Neck in Organic Cotton. This is from Fair Indigo, and I absolutely love this neckline. It is very open, it's not really tight. That's one of the things I can't stand about crew necks is having them really close to my neck. I don't like turtlenecks even because I don't like anything up on my neck. So these fit perfectly for that. They are organic cotton, they come in several colors, they are $37 and they're available on Amazon. While we're on the topic of clothing, I wanted to ask you if you're interested in learning about my journey with my clearing out of my closet. I made a commitment to stop buying fast fashion in 2020. That means that I no longer shop at Target, I no longer shop at Marshalls or TJ Maxx for clothing. And occasionally I will still shop at Nordstrom Rack, but I do not buy any of their items that are fast fashion. I will dig through and look for brands that are not fast fashion and have just ended up at the Nordstrom Rack. Anyway, if you're interested, I can share some of that journey with you in what I've learned. Like finding these t-shirts, I really like the Fair Indigo brand over Everlane. Everlane seems to be rather expensive. The quality of their t-shirts are very uh, poor in my opinion. They're very thin, they stretch out really easily, and they don't last very long. So I was kind of unimpressed with Everlane. I did buy several of their t-shirts until I found the Fair Indigo. If you are interested in learning more about eliminating fast fashion from your closet and why to shop for sustainable clothing, I am working on that through my own closet. And if you want me to share that content with you, please comment below and let me know because I would love to do some content on that. I know it's not hair related, but I think it would be fun to share my journey in putting more sustainable clothing in my closet with you. Number 23 has nothing to do with hair, clothes, skin, or any of that. It's just a really cool find I found for my office that has helped me so much this year, and that is the Ink and Volt dashboard. This thing is so cool. So you have, you can fill in your own dates. So if you go on vacation or whatever, obviously you don't need a dashboard, so you don't waste a page of calendar. Um, it has the week of here, so you can put the week of, and then you can fill in the dates across here. And then it has a little, this week will be blank because of blank. So for me, it was, this week will be fabulous because I'm celebrating 3000 followers. Um, it has top priorities, one, two, and three, simple enough. And then this section here you can see is sort of like a post-it note. So cool because I'm a post-it note girl and I can have 2,000 post-it notes, which makes for a very inefficient desk because eventually I can't see anything for the trees. Um, it has a daily tracker down here. So basically the way I use this is I do my scheduling for videos. I have um, what is, what's in the you know can to be scheduled and published. And then down here, I keep track of what I'm going to try to film for the week and then what I'm gonna publish on the website, what I'm doing for business, uh, what needs to be done for other clients because I still have website businesses, emails, phone calls, etc. The one thing it has taught me is that even though I have a checklist, it doesn't mean I have to accomplish all those things in one week. I can check things off and then as I fill in the week for the next week, I can move those from this week to that week. And if I feel like, hey, I'm not gonna accomplish this anytime soon, I'll move it three weeks away and see if I can accomplish it then but it has been incredibly valuable to me since I juggle so much with YouTube, website, uh, business, and so forth. So it's been great for that. That's it for my 23 favorite things in 2023. I hope you enjoyed all of this. I hope you found something that you will love or that you can gift to someone you love for the holiday season. If you didn't know this already, if you sign up for my emails, which there'll be a link in the description box below, you are automatically enrolled in my annual giveaway. This year's annual giveaway is both oils, a package of clay, and my uh, tote bag. So you'll get a package of clay, both the scalp oil and the squalane oil, my little tote bag with my original design that says salt and pepper with a dash of sass. These are really great tote bags. They're really, they work well for groceries 
for a run to Target or something like that. So sign up for my email list so you can be entered into the annual giveaway. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. And while you're down there, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, because I would love to see you next time. And until then, shine on.